Syria has once again denounced the Israeli regime's repeated attacks on its territory and sovereignty as a threat to regional stability and international peace and security. Basim Sabah, the permanent representative of Syria to the United Nations, made the remarks in letters addressed to the UN Secretary General and the President of the Security Council. Sabah slammed the latest Israeli attacks on Syria, saying they violate the principles of the World Bodies Charter. He also warned about the consequences of the Security Council's negligence of its responsibilities to maintain international peace and security. The Israeli regime recently launched missile attacks on Syrian provinces of Qunaitra, La Daqiya, and Hama, killing one civilian and injuring six others. Our Damascus correspondent Mohammed Ali says the repeated correspondence with the UN shows that Syria unlike Israel, continues to believe in and abide by international law. There is definitely a reason uh, behind uh, such letters. Now, if you ask why the Syrian uh, government always sends such letters to the UN when there are uh, Israeli attacks, uh, while having uh, no actually response on the ground, no measures taken by the UN uh, uh, to uh, stop Israel from carrying out such uh, attacks in the future. The reason is that, according to many analysts, Syria wants to send a message that it will continue uh, to uh, believe uh, and abide by international law and international legitimacy, unlike Israel, which only abides by the law of the jungle. This is something said pre in previous statements uh, by the uh, Syrian uh, government. Uh, uh, the Syrian uh, uh, permanent representative at the United Nations sent two letters to the United Nations Security Council and Secretary General, briefing them, as usual, on the uh, Israeli attacks, which happened on the 5th and 6th of May on Latakia uh, countryside in Masyaf, which killed a, a civilian and injured six others, uh, and also caused material uh, damage. The four, uh, the uh, foreign ministry made it clear in those uh, letters that uh, those both Israeli attacks violate the principles of international law, UN Charter, and uh, UN uh, uh, relevant resolutions, particularly resolutions on the disengagement of forces in the occupied uh, Golan.